poppin' y'all? Welcome back to the vlog channel. Today I am back with another vlog for you, obviously, because you're on the vlog channel. Besides the point, I'm in my new house now. If you haven't seen my empty house tour, then you should definitely go check that out and then come back to this video here because I think I'm gonna show you around the house a little bit. We have a couple things set up, so I might do that. I just got back from Walmart right now and I just filmed a little quick video for Instagram for my Slime Shop account. And yeah, I'm gonna unpack all this stuff from Walmart. I was actually not even going to vlog today. Um, so like, I'm in the middle of my day, I guess you could say. It's legit probably three o'clock right now. And I just barely picked up the vlog, but I was inspired to go ahead and vlog today from one of my unicorn babies. They just asked if I could vlog more, and I was like, you know what? I should probably do that because I have some making up to do for my vlog channel. I was awful with it when I first started, so this is me trying to make up for that. As you can see, Holden is really loving the new place. He has plenty of room to just run around and be crazy. Where's my boy, huh? Where's my boy? <laughs> He's so crazy. I still haven't gotten my TV mounted yet, and I do have a, um, what is that called? An entertainment center now. It's just not set up yet. Um, I guess, give you a view of the living room, why not? Oh, this looks awful on camera. I'm just noticing right now. This couch is actually green. It looks gray on screen. I don't know if it's gonna show up like that once I, like, actually export it, but just know it is not this gray, like, crazy color it's green and that's why the pillows are like kind of leafy greeny you know what I mean um, I have a plant growing over there I have uh, just some decorations on this table here this is a little side table this here is our table coffee table I don't know why that is there um, I got this this that and that from Urban Outfitters that is from Hobby Lobby the pillows are from at home and the couch is from Wayfair okay this is probably like the most awkward angle ever, but whatever. I'm gonna show you a couple of things that I got at Walmart. I'm actually gonna just haul everything probably and just show you what I got because why not? We're gonna start off with what is in here. Ow, I hit my face. Don't know if you caught that, but um, thumbnail. Um, it's just a bunch of stuff, so I'm gonna show you. Take out bag by bag. So. We have meal prep food storage containers. I got these because, um, you know, if I have leftovers, stuff like that. I don't meal prep, but if I have leftovers, I would love to store them in something. These are dishwasher safe, microwavable safe, and freezer safe. So this is A1 for sure. I got some cornstarch for slime, obviously, because I love putting these in my cloud creams. If you didn't know, that's like my secret ingredient for the sizzliest cloud cream ever. So I got some of these. I got a lot more than these, but this is just what's in this bag right here. Holden is playing with something down there, so don't mind him. I also got a bunch of cooking utensils because I cooked breakfast this morning for me and my mother, and I realized I had no utensils, so it was a little awkward, <laughs> but we got through it, and breakfast was actually delicious. So I have a spatula, a little spoon thingy here, and another spatula here. And I have some strainers. These are actually from Tasty. If you didn't know, it's BuzzFeed's um, cooking show on Facebook. Um, I didn't know that they had a line at Walmart, but they do, so that's kind of cool. Now, in this bag here, I got some Starbucks caramel flavored coffee for the Keurig. These are the K-Cups. Um, I also got some Equal because my mom likes to put Equal in her coffee. I put sugar in mine, but she likes the Equal, so got her that. I also got some neon food colorings. I got four of them to be exact because I was running out on mine and I love using those. Um, I got some straws as well because, you know, your boy likes to drink out of straws. What can I say? In this bag right here, I got a little pasta fork is what it's called. I didn't know that till right now, but it says pasta fork, so it must be a pasta fork. Um, you know, you just stick it in there and grab your pasta. I don't know, apparently you need these things when you're an adult, you know? Um, I got some rock candy uh, candle wax to go with this wax warmer here because I really wanted one. I used to have a really nice one, but I broke it when I moved out of my other house, not the previous one, but the one before that. So finally got another one. I think I got two bags here. So I have some wooden toothpicks. These are not actually like for me to pick my teeth, obviously. Uh, well, not obviously, because these are wooden, but I don't know if you know this. It's kind of dangerous. You might get a splinter because they're wooden. I actually use these to test cakes. So like when I'm um, making a cake, you just insert a toothpick in the middle. If it comes out clean, it is good. So that is what those are for. I got some coasters because I needed some of those. 
This one here is a gingerberry margarita wax melt for the wax warmer as well. So that is cool. These smell really good, by the way. I also got some double zipper snap and click great value fresh scent bags. That was a lot to say, but um, I didn't have any bags, so I got those. So I'm gonna get some like better sandwich bags and stuff because I need those, but that's what I got for now. For those of you who don't know, I basically moved kind of like away from the city. I'm not like deep into the city, but I'm not too far, but the nearest Walmart is like 10 to 12 minutes away from me, and that is like the closest supermarket, so. Yeah, my mom's here. My brother's here. I got some gum because you know sometimes you just need some gum I like to chew gum when I edit sometimes so I'm going to put this in my filming room slash Office and then this here is a huge trash can the lid is inside I'm actually going to be putting this one in the slime room because we accumulate a lot of trash obviously so Gotta have somewhere to put that. I also filled up a huge hamper with stuff. Oh my god in this bag here It's just you know the little divider thingies for your forks and stuff you kind of need that stuff when you become an adult, apparently, so I got that. This bag here, it's just some towels. This is a bath towel, it's gray, it's nice. It matches my towels that I have now. I got some of this stuff because you just never know. Uh, I also got a mouse pad because I just got my MacBook and, or it's not a MacBook, it's an iMac, but the mouse is awful like trying to use it on glass because my desk is glass which is also new by the way um so i'm gonna use this instead and hopefully it you know navigates easier i don't know these beige towels here are actually gonna go in the guest bathroom because that is kind of the color scheme over there so that was ketchup by the way <laughs> so yeah that's gonna go in the guest bathroom then in this box and in this box, I bought more cereal as if I needed any more, but I saw these new ones and I have to get them. So these are the Golden Oreo O's. And down here, we have Cookies and Cream Dippin' Dots, and then Banana Split Dippin' Dots. So, had to grab those. I like weird cereals, I don't know. I also got an iron and an ironing board, but that is in my garage and it's way too hot. I don't feel like grabbing that, so got that because I didn't have one and then obviously I have this clothes hamper here to put all of my dirty clothes in once I've finished wearing them to take them to the washroom and wash them you know remember I said I bought more cornstarch I wasn't lying so I have a total of one two three four five six more bottles of cornstarch and then I also got some Nutella because my mom made me she guilted me into it I was trying to stay strong, but she was like, no, you like Nutella. <laughs> so I was like, you know what, okay. And then I got this canister here for um, sugar. I'm gonna put like regular sugar into this. Kind of boring, but whatever. This here is a little trash can. It has a little steps thing so you can open it. This is actually for the office slash filming room. So that's why it's so small. I don't really accumulate any trash in there, but you never know, I've only been here like two days. And the last item, I got some regular Folgers classic roast K-Cups because my mom is basic, she doesn't like regular like, or she only likes regular coffee, she doesn't like anything flavored. So, you know, got that for her. Oh. Gonna get a salad. Boom, look at that. That looks good actually. I'm gonna eat this salad while they're eating burgers. Sorry. I want it to be known. <laughs> Um, but yeah, just made a fresh batch of Baja Blast for the restock. It's amazing. Mom is over here making some buttercream slime. Say hi, Mom. <laughs> he really loves the bean bag. <laughs> Hold in. What are you doing, crazy boy? What are you doing, crazy boy? <laughs> So we are back from our walk now and I am packaging up some slime for the restock that is tomorrow. This one here is Lightning Lemonade and it smells like pink lemonade, it's really nice. Sorry the music is probably so loud in the background, but I am jamming and Holden was playing with his toy. I don't know what he's doing now. What you doing, baby? Wanna say hi? Say hi, hi everyone. Good morning everyone, it is the next day, August the 4th, 
Yes, because tomorrow's my birthday, August 5th, Sunday. Just letting y'all know. Anyways, um, it is the next day. It's August the 4th. It is restock day. Um, we normally restock on Friday, obviously, but we are now restocking on a Saturday this week only. Just because, you know, I moved and we were a little busy, so we didn't have time to make that many slimes. So I asked you all on Instagram if you wanted me to just postpone it a little bit, and you all said yes. That way you can have more slime. So that is what I did. I have been up packaging some slime. I want to try to see here. Bam. Bam. These are the unicorn frappuccino slimes. They look so cute. I am in love with them. And they come with a little whipped cream topping. Two ounce buttercream slime. It just doesn't want to focus. But you know. Oh, I think it's focused now. Okay, I can't tell. Anyways, um, so yeah, I packaged those. These are what we have of the clear slimes. I didn't make that many this week. I still have to package a couple of other slimes. Um, I'm going to do that right now. I'm just going to make myself some coffee because it is way too early to be even up. It's like 8.03. So yeah. Now I can fully awaken. It just touches your soul in the morning, you know? A good cup of coffee. Alrighty, so I'm taking a quick break right now. I was working on things for the shop, like getting the restock video done, doing voiceovers, and then also um, taking pictures of all the signs and then putting them on the shop. So I am taking a break with that right now. I'm almost finished, but I am starving. I haven't eaten breakfast yet, and it is now one. Oh, three. So I probably should eat something. I know that's really bad to skip breakfast, but I had coffee, so I'm good. Uh, I'm not gonna like die. Um, but what I am gonna do right now is I'm gonna make an acai bowl right now because I have an acai sorbet slime that smells so, so good. And it's just making me want some acai. So I'm gonna make an acai bowl with a bunch of fruit and granola. Really excited. Okay, so this here is organic, unsweetened acai, just like blended up. Just gonna squeeze two packs of this into my blender here if it'll come out. What are you doing with your life? There you go. <laughs> okay, so there's one pack. And I have another one right here. So I'm going to throw that one in as well. have two packs of the blended acai in here. Now I'm going to add a fourth of a cup of vanilla almond milk. I'm using vanilla instead of um, like the original unsweetened because the acai is unsweetened. So we need a little bit of sweetness in there. This is going to give us a little bit. I'm using silk almond milk. I'm also going to add half of a banana. It's just going straight in there. And the other half of the banana I'm gonna save to put on top because I like some banana pieces in there. I'm also going to add a little squeeze of organic honey. And this might seem pointless, but I'm adding just a couple of ice cubes just to make sure everything stays nice and cold and like frosty-like. So now I'm going to go ahead and put this on the blender attachment and blend it all together. Okay, so our acai is all blended up now. I'm gonna place this in the freezer just until I cut up my fruits and stuff. Okay, so I'm just gonna chop up my bananas into little discs. Just for, you know, garnish and stuff. I don't like these little ends. I don't know why they freak me out, so I'm going to give it to Holden. I'm sure he will love it. A banana. Good boy. Okay, I just washed these strawberries. I'm going to go ahead and cut these as well. I want to cut the little greens off of them first. Because those don't taste very nice. Just what? Cut, 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 cut. They're pretty firm strawberries. I guess they're not like in their ripe state. I don't know. I'm not a berry expert, but that is kind of what it would tell me. Oh my goodness. <laughs> they're like super hard, almost like frozen. It's crazy. So then I'm just gonna cut them into little, I don't know what you call those. I almost cut them in like thirds, I guess. Oh, this one is frozen. That's crazy. I guess my freezer's, my fridge is like really cold. Ow, I almost cut myself. 
Okay, if you're a child, make sure you have your parent ask for help. I mean, <laughs> have your parent help you. Ask for help is what I meant to say. Okay, so I have my bowl. I'm going to empty my acai in there. Make sure to get every last drop. I'm going to layer my bananas here. Just like that. I'm going to bunch my strawberries on this side. Just kind of any which way that looks pretty or something, I don't know. I like to think that I'm a chef, but I'm not. Now I have some blueberries, I'm gonna put some on this side and some on this side here. And then I'm going to add some of this Nature Valley granola with protein. I'm gonna add it right in the center. This is my favorite part because it's probably the most unhealthiest. And then to top that all off, I'm gonna go back in with my honey and just do a little drizzle because I like it very sweet and this is organic honey. And of course, have to take a picture for the gram or it didn't happen. Okay, let's get a live taste test reaction. I'm gonna get some banana, some acai, and try to get everything, blueberry, strawberry, and I need some granola in my life, it's my favorite, let's see. Mmm. It is super cold but that is delicious. So the shop is opening up in less than 10 minutes. I am finishing the salad that I had the other day because I did not finish it. And then I have some sweet tea that I'm drinking there and hold in just once a bite of my salad. Sorry, dude. Um, but yeah, I just uploaded the restocking video. So that is up now and it's doing pretty darn well if I say so myself. So yeah. So the shop hasn't even opened yet and there are 74 people waiting right now on the landing page. We have seven minutes to go. This is wild. Well, would you look at that? More people are coming up. We have three minutes left and there is 97 people waiting now and Holden is just having a fit because he wants the salad. Dude, can you chill? You know you can't have human food. Why are you being crazy? And I am back. I am showered and changed. I actually am going to be leaving soon. I'm gonna take Holden for a walk. But then after that, my brother is actually having this thing. He went to a church retreat and they're having like a ceremony, I guess, or something like that for the family. So I'm going to support my brother. So I'm going to do that right after I take Holden out. I'm going to head out, so. Yeah, I probably should end the vlog here, I think, because tomorrow's my birthday and I want that to be a separate vlog because we're doing something super exciting. So, I am gonna go ahead and say goodbye now. Thank you all so much for watching this vlog. I really hope that it was at least a little bit entertaining. My life is kind of not that interesting, but somebody might find it interesting, who knows. Um, yeah, thank you all so much for watching this vlog. I love you all very freaking much and I will see you all next time. Bye!